Hey guys, Jake with HHA. Got another exciting new product for you uh, within our Tetra lineup for 2024. We have the Tetra and Tetra Max Rise X3. So the X3 being our three pin movable site. Um, you're gonna notice it looks very similar to some of our past uh, Tetra, Rise, and four pin sites that we've had here over the last couple of years. Um, but with some modifications to it to really make it the most uh, technical site that we've kind of ever offered. Um, but it's also a site that's, that's easy to set up, um, it's real clean, and I think it's something you're gonna like. So just kind of starting off, we have the Tetra, which is gonna be built off of our existing Tetra line. That's gonna be the Tetra Rise X3. So it's gonna have that fixed yardage wheel, not removable, uh, but it is gonna come in at a nice price point. Um, and you're gonna notice that it has three adjustable indicators on the side of the yardage wheel. So you're gonna be able to set each pin in your scope uh, to a yardage on your yardage wheel, allowing you to have uh, what we call triple point. So three different yardages uh, that you can always shoot at regardless of where you dial your sight to. Uh, next feature that you're gonna notice right off the bat is the scope size is reduced uh, in size from the four pin that we've offered in the past. It's an inch and five eighths, which is the same as all of our rise scopes. It's a little bit of a deeper scope though, uh, to allow for the, for the pins to sit in there comfortably, as well as our micro and macro windage adjustment. So um, really nice features there that we were able to add in to cut down on some weight. Uh, kind of jumping back in, some of the standard features that you're always accustomed to seeing in the Tetra uh, rise and the Tetra lineup is gonna be that windage system that I mentioned earlier. You're gonna have micro and macro windage adjustment. Um, so really nice for fine tuning your setup on the range. In addition to that, you're gonna get the infinite adjust system, which is gonna allow you to fine tune your setup at 20 yards. Um, and that's gonna allow you to get more distance out of your pins as well. So another feature uh, that we have in the, the X3 lineup, both on the Tetra Max and the Tetra, uh, is gonna be our second and third axis adjustment. So we do have videos on how to do that. We do recommend that uh, an experienced bow technician sets your second and third axis for you. Uh, but we do have videos of that on our YouTube channel, so you can check that out as well. Also gonna notice we brought back the integrated sight ring on the front of the scope. It's nice. It's a nice bright green uh, sight ring, able to, able to align your peep sight uh, quickly for that. Jumping kind of into the Tetra Max lineup, gonna have all those same features that I talked about in the Tetra but you're gonna add the ability to remove that yardage wheel, which is extremely nice, uh, especially with these three indicators. It's a little bit easier to apply a sight tape on the Tetra Max uh, Rise X3 than it is on the Tetra Rise X3, just because you're able to pop that wheel on and off. Like I said, a lot of similarities to that past lineup, but the big, the big difference being that reduced scope size for the three pin, the inch and 5 eighths scope, we're able to cut down on some weight and the triple point technology where you're able to have uh, multiple yardages set in matching your pins and your scope. So we're really excited about that. In addition to that, all these sites are all gonna come with our Rise long distance tapes. So looking at the different frame options within the Tetra Rise X3 lineup and the Max X3 lineup, you're gonna get a fixed hunter frame in both. Uh, the Picatinny mount, which is gonna fit Hoyt, uh, PSC, and any of the new uh, bow manufacturers that are coming out with pick models uh, for this year, as well as our short and long bar dovetail options that are going to be compatible on the Matthews Bridge Lock system. Those same four frames are going to be available in the Tetra Max as well. Uh, you got a fixed hunter frame on the Max, you got the pick mount, short bar dovetail, and the long bar dovetail. So a lot of different options. So on all eight of these different uh, X3 site options, just as are any HHA product, uh, everything is made here in the States. It's American made and we back it with a lifetime warranty. We take a lot of pride in our customer service. If you ever have any issues, uh, feel free to reach out to us. Um, and if you have any questions, you can visit our website at hhasports.com.